Hello everybody, what's up? Today I'll be showing you how to use Ultra VNC or Ultra Virtual Network Computing. Now, here it is right here, and I'm going to show you how, how to use it. Let's get it. Alright, so here we are on our PC. Um, link will be in the description below. I want you guys to subscribe, like the video, and share to your friends. And also comment to see what you think of this. And, yeah. So, in the description... The link will be in the description to download this. But you want to use the zip file. Do not get the setup. Use the zip. And extract the zip. And after you extract it, go to time 64. You can use time 68 as a backup. Now, it would pop up here. Forget about this client file. All right? You would open this. But I already have everything set up. But first. Oh, no. Wait, I don't think I was supposed to do that. Uh, it's fine. I already got another one set up. So we got another one here. But after you set up your password and everything right here. um, Just say, just set up your password. Mine's going to be 1234, obviously, because why not? So then you want to make a new folder right here and just name it client. Well, I spelled client wrong, but client right here. You want to move the files Ultra VNC and WinVNC to the client file. Then make a new text document and just name it main. Okay? So then, um, I'm going to show you everything here. So just give me one second. But yeah, uh, blah, 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 after that, um, you're going to want to run the main bat file. Then, run, open command prompt from the 86 file. So put in cmd, and I'll open it from here. So see, my username, blah, 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 and then 86. So type in vnc viewer dash list in and then your port hold on one of it's already running so give me a moment alright so if it's already running copy this and paste and then do it again boom a little icon should pop up down there then open up the main dot file Oh god, here we are. So, here it is. It might be a little bit laggy because this is just my thing. It's literally my desktop. Because look, there's two mouses if you go over. Cool, right? So... What I'm going to do is I'm going to move this to something called Oracle VM or uh, v whatever, where, and it's going to do VirtualBox, which will set up a PC for me. Be right there in a moment. Alright, so we're now in the Windows thing, so I'm going to open up the file from here, downloads, client, and then main. And as you can see, on mine, it pops up this. And I get to control their screen. So, hold on. I want to show you this. So, I can just transfer files, right? So, watch this. Open file transfer, right? Let's say... If I want to send them a document file, like my computer, you know, and send it to their desktop. So my computer, how to do or use it, and send it to its desktop. Now, if we look back, what's that? 
So let's go open it on our virtual box computer. All right, so we're on the virtual box computer and open this. Um, W. So yeah, you can transfer anything. And you can delete them. It's so fun. And I'll show you another cool thing. You can shut down their monitor, like literally. This thing up here, no, this. Toggle, toggle remote input and remote blank monitor. If I click it, what just happened? Why is it all black? Don't click that. But um, what's this doing is, well, they can't see the screen, but you can. But if you unlock it, it'll be back there. You can chat with them. As I was saying, you can chat with them, and this is mine right here. This is theirs. So, let's say if I put hi. It would pop up over here with my local IP. My local, not, not private, local. And I would say, hello. See? And just send a smiley face to creep them out and bum. Now this is used for educational, educational purposes only. Do not use this for any bad sort of thing. If you do, where's my freaking goober? And whatever. IRS, go kill that guy. Uh, I'm just kidding. They wouldn't kill you, but you probably get arrested for hacking and getting their IP. I don't even know at this point, but. Yeah, you should be able to get it. That's what I'm saying. So, yeah, go for it. Only use this to prank your friends, because if you're going to prank your friends, just do it. But if you're using an Ethernet cable, it probably won't work. <laughs> because it don't work for me, man, for an Ethernet cable. So, and if you close it out, I'll just close it out. And I'll show you how to get virtual box in a later video so thank you guys for watching so much i really appreciate your help in everything also a little bit of a quick reminder join our discord for early game pass tatsumaki updates and we can give a tatsumaki game pass to you or early access for a new character so join our discord link will be in the description have a great day. Bye.